Just another beautiful springtime day in San Francisco. How often do you get to see wildflowers in San Francisco? Isn't that beautiful? Look at that. I'll show you all the people that are scurrying to work. Well, actually it's President's Day, so there are not too many people scurrying to work, which is fantastic for us because we're scurrying. We are scurrying to work. <laughs> Mike, are we scurrying to work? Yes, yes we are. What's making it really difficult in this neighborhood to scurry to work? Why is it so difficult? All the cars that's parked on the side of the road. <laughs> Trying to all get, the, we've been, it all took the it, hills. it's taken us like a uh, half an hour to drive a mile getting through all these little slots and stuff here. I mean, it's just crazy, dealers and trees. But the reason we're making a video right now is, uh, and if you need a free fan, there's one here. So just so you know. Um, why are we making a video? We're making a video because of this really cool ficus tree. This is ficus nidida, uh, the Indian fig. It's a great tree for a lot of reasons. It's really lush looking, it's drought tolerant. It does have a very aggressive root system. So you have to be kind of careful. Uh, it has a really beautiful uh, white trunk and it makes it for a wondrous dense shade tree. And there's a couple of videos I have on this tree already. Maybe I'll try to link them all together here. But the reason that I got stopped in my tracks, like what's so cool? What's so cool about this tree? Mike, what's Root so cool? A root that's coming over the side of the, the wall. A what? Yeah. What? <laughs> 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 Look at that. Ah. Oh, Look at that's that. so cool. I've never seen that. Me neither. I've seen some fun stuff before. But never. I've seen this, these trees do fun things before. Look at this. Man, I was like, how the heck did that happen? Pretty soon someone's going to come. We have to stop the video. But no, look at this. So let's see. Let's just, let's just work it out. So the tree decides to be like... Uh, all right, I'm gonna do multiple jobs here. I wanna do a job of giving people shade, uh, birds food for all the little baby figs that it makes, and, uh, and I'm gonna make everything look beautiful. But you know what? I'm gonna do an additional job. I'm gonna hold up this wall. <laughs> I'm gonna reach out, hold up this wall. So, yeah, so somehow this tree, its root, it just, I guess it was confused. It just decided to, it's a pretty thick wall. Let's see what happened here. Oh, look, okay. So what must have happened here, I'm gonna guess that this thing sprouted a root. Wow, this wall goes really far back, like way back to here. So it sprouted a root down in the duck, just like these kind of little roots. Then the root uh, hit the top of the wall and there were a bunch of leaves here. Then the root just came along, came along, came along and just like, well, this is not gonna stop me. It looks like an anaconda. But uh, then it got to the edge and it's like, well, I don't, I probably shouldn't go up, go down. Then when it got all the way down to the ground, look, here's the little hair roots. It was this big when it got to the bottom and there was a tiny little crack. It's like, Mike, can you say tiny little crack? Tiny little crack. A tiny little crack. <laughs> and then the root just went, oops, oh, I'm gonna go down here, yeah. And then the root got bigger and bigger and bigger and bigger and then spread out. And now we've got the only root I've ever seen uh, coming over a concrete wall and then um, locking into the bottom of that wall. And now the wall, no matter uh, what happens, it's not going to fall over. So anyway, Mike, was that worthy for, of, of a stop? Oh, definitely. Yeah. All right. Okay. Well, you think we should go back to work now? <laughs> yeah. Okay. That's it. Nothing to see here. Nothing to see here. Nothing to see here.